Hey, Neil, you're on. Oh, you're on, you're on mute, Neil. Oh, there you go. I didn't expect you to talk to me that quick. Hi. <laughs> All right. Hi. Um, yeah. Well, anyway, let me start her up again. Uh, yeah. So thanks for being here. Uh, and again, uh, um, as we've been reiterating, happy Memorial Day. Thanks to all of our servicemen and women who uh, have taken the ultimate sacrifice uh, for our freedom. So keep them in your minds, and, and I hope we'll uh, have a, a great rest of the day here for uh, the YouTubers Ham Fest. So I have Neil Rapp here to talk about Youth on the Air. Um, you may have heard that our Youth on the Air program has been postponed, or our camp has been postponed from 2020 to 2021. Um, but uh, we are still chugging along. We have some new events. So, uh, Neil, go ahead. Okay, yeah. Uh, just a, a quick um, intro to Youth on the Air. Um, Sterling and Sam, uh, KC2LRC, uh, went to uh, Austria and to the Youngsters on the Air camp uh, a few years ago and kind of went with the intent of copying and stealing everything and, and bringing it over here. Yep. And um, so we're finally getting that going. And um, COVID-19 decided to uh, delay that a year, but uh, we're, we're, we're making do. Um, we actually uh, are coming out pretty good out of it. We're all disappointed, of course, but uh, financially, I think our loss was a, a whopping 30 bucks. Um, and, uh, we've got everything set up just to, to do it next year. So we're postponing it. So everything's still kind of along the same, uh, plan. Uh, I'm sure we'll have to change a few things mm -hmm. due to schedules, but, um, but the idea is to, um, get youth together and get them working on things and helping each other and, and trying to, um, keep our youth in amateur radio. Um, you know, there's a lot of initiatives on getting kids into ham radio and, and we're all for that. Of course. Yep. Um, we just had a new <clears throat> 10 year old. We, we posted something about, uh, uh, that I, I got an email from uh, that was wanting to get involved in, in the program and um, just got his license. But um, we're, we're really focused on keeping kids in ham radio. We're, we're not really focused on getting kids in ham radio. Uh, we have hundreds of kids in ham radio. Mm -hmm. um, we just don't have <clears throat> that much out there for them. Uh, we, we have a few little things here and there. And so we're trying to add to that collection. Yep. We're not trying to replace that collection. We're trying to add to that collection by doing this camp. Yeah. I'll mention, uh, uh, I'll go ahead and so, mention that yeah. a couple of those things is, uh, that are out there. Um, you have uh, the Young Amateurs Communication Ham Team, that's Yacht. And I think Dennis or, or Denny uh, K5DCC has been around. So appreciate him for um, running uh, that with Ed. And then you also have the Young Amateurs Radio Club, which I'm a part of. Uh, Yark.world is their website, and that's a Discord server for, for many, many young hams. And we'll have some people, uh, some kids from uh, the Remote Ham Radio, and talk about their youth, youth initiative kind of all over the place. And I think Yoda will sort of serve as, as the collection, collection point, meeting point, kind of saying, like, here's all of the youth resources that we have to offer for, for young hams out there. Yeah, and, and you know it, it's uh, it's going to be a great week when we get together, but we're going to try to get everybody together um, on Zoom for a day uh, during the camp and, and do a little bit of stuff. So you know, again, they can get to know each other and and get to know um, you know their expertise. Um, and, and the big focus too is that the young people are are teaching most of this. Um, mm -hmm. We have just about everything taught by young hams. Um, and by young, we're talking, you know, 30 and under. Yep. Um, yeah, it's not just kids. Like, like you know, yeah. like a lot of people think, oh, I want to get my seven-year-old son or daughter into ham radio. It's it, it runs a whole gamut of, I think, 30 is probably an upper age of, of youth, but um, but really you don't, we don't try to put too much of a, a definition on it. It's, it's just, are you, even if you're youth at heart, you know, if you're really engaged yeah. with the, with young people, then. 
Now, now for the camp, we do have uh, a, a limit of, of 15 to 25. Um, we'll push that a year or two, if, you know, if we have a recommendation, there's some circumstances there, but that's, that's just to kind of keep things going. And, and, you know, I've had several requests for, you know, well, I've got a 10 year old mm -hmm. and I'm like, well, yeah, yeah, it breaks my heart to say no, but, um, uh, because so much of this is a social thing, not just a ham radio thing, we, we kind of felt like we need to do that, but I'd, I'd love to have a, a kid's version. Yeah, I, I really would. But, and, and the hope is eventually that the young people are doing most of the planning, you know, we're setting up the first one, Yeah. but, uh, hopefully the young people then, you know, can kind of see how that goes and then model it and run with it. And, and then duplicate it mm -hmm. so that we're not just having one but not just the only one a lot like yeah. so this all comes from the yoda camp from before and they have all these sub-regional camps and that's all completely led by young people and i'm i'm 28 and i'm considered uh, besides connor in the chat saying that yep. i'm an om um, <laughs> i'm pretty young as, as ham radio goes but but even then like uh, the people over in uh, yoda are, are much younger than me and much more much have, have much more spry in their step if you will so uh, Neil, do you have any slides or anything? We'll have about yeah, yeah. Let me uh, let me so. pull that up actually because um, there is a, something new that's just developed in the last couple of days. Um, so let me talk a little bit about that. All right. Um, by the way, we'll, we'll put the sales pitch here. Uh, YouthOnTheAir.org is where you will find us, and uh, we try to link any youth related activity now nets the, the awrl has a youth nets page so we just link to that uh but for youth related activities uh camps uh you know contesting that kind of thing uh we try to list that so if, if you know something's not on there let us know but we're trying to do that for all of the americas and um, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube are there. It's Yoda Region 2 um, that uh, we're under for that. Um, but w we do try to promote everything. We really only have two activities so far. Um, the summer camp and then uh, Yoda Month in December. Mm -hmm. uh, we have uh, special event calls for throughout the month of December and Young Hams take turns operating those special event stations. Uh, but those are really the only two things we have until until this new one that I'm just getting ready to, to talk about. Um, and, you know, we are set financially for next year, uh, but we're, we're already, you know, working on the next one. So if you'd like to donate, by all means, go, go right ahead. Um, but this is brand new. Uh, this is Yoda Online. This has just been uh, formally announced in the last couple of days. And Youngsters on the Air, which is the, um, the original um, over in Europe <clears throat> and Africa and the Middle East, which is in IARU Region 1. Um, they tend to know their IARU regions better than we do here in the mm -hmm. U.S., but... Uh, anyway, they're putting this on, but it's a worldwide thing. So we are inviting all of our uh, people in the Americas, which, by the way, is Region 2. Um, right. We're inviting all of our young hams, um, and, and their definition is under 26. So we always say 25 and under. They, they say under 26. But um all young hams to participate and this is just going to be kind of a meeting it's it's kind of like a, a club meeting but it, it's going to be a little more structured uh but young people are going to be doing presentations um and the first one is going to be may 28th so um if you're under 26 uh, put this on your calendar. First meeting, May 28th. Uh, it's at 1800 UTC. It'll be about an hour. We're going to have uh, a young person presenting on a topic. And I won't divulge that yet. Uh, but we will have some prizes at the end. And the link to this is going to be posted the day before. Okay. 
Um, so what you do is just go to the Youngsters on the Air website, which is ham-yoda, H-A-M-Y-O-T-A.com. And the link to Zoom or whatever it's on, I, I, they haven't even said for sure what it's on yet. Yeah. But um, whatever that's on or any of their Ham Yoda social media, and we'll try to retweet that and put that on our site too. But um, And that's going to be out there on May 27th. And if you miss it, of course, it'll be recorded and uh, it'll be on the YouTube channel for youngsters on the air. And again, we'll try to, to repost everything because it, it's their thing, but they've invited everyone um, across the world to participate. And, mm -hmm. and Thailand's got things going over in Region 3, too. So, right. yeah, so I've heard we're, some news we've got. Out there. We've got some things going now. They they or we're going we're going to have their camp in October, and um, they've already postponed. So right. uh, they're kind of in the same boat as as us. But but this is something that youngsters on the air decided to do because all of these events are canceled. The, right. Their youth right. contesting program things have been canceled. The sub regional camps have been canceled. The main camp, which theirs was going to be in Croatia, ours was going to be in Cincinnati and then, you know, in region three in, in Thailand, all of those things have been postponed. So, yep. um, uh, this was kind of their answer to it. So, yeah. uh, Yoda online, it's, it's, it's brand new and we'll, we'll see how it goes. Yeah. We're that's really cool. Trying it out. I'm really excited. And I'm, I'm pretty much in the dark. I love how they keep a, keep an air of mystery and that's going to really bring in a lot of, a lot yeah, of Yeah, they do. So I had to pry. Exciting. Yeah. I had to pry. <laughs> I can't wait to see what it is. But that's, I mean, that's why we're here at the, at the YouTubers Ham Fest, uh, because COVID killed the, the Ham Fest star. So um, hopefully it's uh, enjoyable. And um, our 296 people I see on my count are getting a lot out of this. I've had a lot of people in the chat asking, how do I join Yoda? Um, so that's really exciting. Got a lot of young people in here. So, all right, Neil, this has been great. Are there any more um, news to uh, share? I'm, I'm looking at my clock here, so I, I think uh, the only other thing that I will uh, that I will share is, um, like I said, we are planning for a kind of a day long online camp in June during that week that we're going to that we were going to have the camp, and I'm kind of thinking we we may run that special event called W8Y that week mm -hmm. since we we have the call sign. Oh, yeah. Um, so we may still be on the air that week, and it's the week leading up to field day. So um, we're, we're going to start getting those plans finalized. Um, I've, I've done a little bit of work on it, but uh, we need to put that together. But we're going to get everybody together um, and... And um, we 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 have we have a big prize to give away. Ooh. <laughs> so so there's the air of mystery. We yeah, we have a big exciting. prize to give away. So can't wait. Um, so we'll uh, we'll get that going next month, and um, and that'll be specifically for people in the Americas. But uh, again, Yoda Online is uh, is for everybody under 26. So all right, awesome. Well, there hope everybody, go. hope I see everyone there. Okay, Neil, it's been a pleasure. Let's uh, say 73 to you, and, and thanks a lot for, for coming in and talking about Yoda. 73. All right.